right now. Um, but yeah, so this video, if you can tell already, is a hair care routine. And I have it, this is also another video. I'm kind of like going back deep into my videos and picking out ones that I haven't done in a really long time. I'm thinking of maybe doing a what's in my purse soon, so if you want that, then comment down below. But, um, yeah, so I haven't done a hair care routine in very long time, and I just have a lot of new products that I have been using since the last one, They're like really different products, and um, yeah, so I think I'm just gonna get right into it. Okay, so I'm gonna be careful because the last time I filmed this, I like, you know how it like water collects in the caps of some like bottles in the shower? Yeah, and then it spilled all over me, so I'm gonna be careful now. So yeah, um, starting off with shampoo, I only have one shampoo that I use. Um, this is the Herbal Essences Long Term Relationship Shampoo for Long Hair with Raspberry and Silk Extracts. This smells so good, oh my god. And it just makes your hair feel so soft and it feels like it's actually like a really good shampoo. I hate those shampoos that make your hair, like it makes your hair feel squeaky like clean, but it doesn't make it like, like what, I hate those squeaky feelings that it's like drying. I don't know, I don't like that. And this lathers really nicely. That's one thing for me that I really look for in a shampoo. And also has keratin protection. I didn't know that. So that's a plus also. And I started off with the smaller version of this with the same size as the conditioner. But you know the conditioner always lasts like three years and the shampoo lasts like a week. So that's my thing. <laughs> and yeah, I used up a lot of it. But it's such a good shampoo. And yeah. Then for conditioner, I like to be like economical kind of like I don't even know if that's the right term but I'm saying like since conditioner lasts so much longer I kind of like to mix them sometimes so I had this for a while and I used up the whole shampoo so I got the big one but I also had this one left over so I just mix these two together and yeah because I'm trying to like finish this because I guess I abandoned it but I, I like this one and I like this one because they're similar well, they just have different smells, that's what I think, but may they have different, like, things that they do, I guess, I don't know. But anyway, so this one is the same thing as the Herbal Essences Long-Term Relationship Conditioner for Long Hair with Raspberry and Silk Extracts, Keratin Protection, and it's just a really smooth conditioner, I like that, and it's, like, medium to light thickness, like... I don't know how to, mm, yeah, medium to light thickness, and this one as well. And this is the Herbal Essences Honey M Strong Strengthening Conditioner with honey and apricot extract. And it just, I think it's supposed to repair, and this one is supposed to help long hair. I don't know. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I think this one is just to keep your hair long and healthy. This one is supposed to, like, repair. I don't know, that's what it says. But yeah, I really like these two together. They smell really nice and they work really well. Then for after the shower, I have things I put in my hair. And the first thing, I think this might have been in my, like the video that I did before this for the hair care routine. I don't remember, but I've had this for a while. This is a second bottle. This is the Garnier Fructis Style with Fruit Micro Waxes, Sleek and Shine Anti-Humidity Smoothing Milk. And this is the Instant Smoothing and Frizz Control Strong. Um, this is like, it's just supposed to help with frizzing and stuff. I don't know if it really, like, it kind of helps. But I just, like, when my hair, I didn't brush it yet. I put it on my palm and I put it all through my hair top to ends. And I brush it through and it kind of helps to brush because it's like, like smoothing. I don't know how to explain it. But yeah, this works for me. I use it. And then after that... I like to use the Bumble and uh, this one is in my earlier one, I know. This is the Bumble and Bumble Hairdresser's Invisible Oil for Sublime Softness. And I just put two pumps on my palm and I rub it into my hands. And then I just put it on the ends of my hair, probably from like here down. And I just really work it in there when it's like kind of damp, like drying, in the process of drying. And yeah, it makes my hair really soft at the ends and I like that. Or sometimes if I know that I'm going to be using heat later on, I like to use my It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In Plus Keratin. Um, I like using, I don't like using this every single day or like every time I wash my hair because I just, I like this so much and it was kind of like pricey. 
I mean, yeah, it was pretty, it was okay. Like, I don't like spending money on things that, like, I don't need to use every single time. I mean, I like how that process works after the shower, but this one also works really nicely. And I just, I used up, like, less than half of it, and I've had this for a really long time. I'm just trying to conserve it because I really like it, and, but yeah, this is, I've mentioned this plenty of times, and I'm not going to read the ten things it does instantly because I've shared it so many times. And it's just a waste of time, so. But yeah, so that's my whole hair care routine.